All right, this is our 116. So they define P as a product from the integers 1 to 30, including 1 to 30. And I'm trying to figure out how many factors of 3 are in, in that product. So what I do is I look at each number, each of those numbers, each of those factors, and see how, see how many factors of 3 are in each one. Well, 1 doesn't have a factor of 3. 2, no, 3, it's 3 times 1. I'm going to do tally marks. 3, okay, uh, 4, no, 5, no. When I say no, there's no factors. 6, well, there's one factor of 3. 7, no, 8, no, 9, there's two factors of 3. So I guess I'm summing here. Now, I think I will do tally marks. All right, so uh, I've got 4 so far. Where am I? 10, no, 11, no, 12. 12 is 4 times 3. That's another one. That's 12, 13, no, 14, no, 15. 15 is 3 times 5. That's another one. 16, no, 17, no, 18 is 6, 18 is 9 times 2. So you've got 2 more. Uh, 19, no, 20, no, 21, yes, there's a factor of 3. 22, no, 23, no, 24. 24 is, 24 is 8 times 3. You've got another one. Uh, 24, 25, no, 26, no, 27 is is 9 times 3. That's 3, 3, 3, uh, 3 factors of 3. 28, no, 29, no, 30. 30 is 3 times 10. So that would be 1. So 5, 10, looks like 14. So the answer's C.